making his way to the ring, C.W. Anderson, the enforcer, C.W. Anderson. Yes, one of the ECW greats, and he has the most beautiful spinebuster you have ever seen. Yes. You know, a lot of people like to say uh, Arn Anderson has a great spine buster. Even um, guys like Triple H, but for my money, I think C.W. Anderson definitely has maybe the best spine buster in the game today. And if he hits that tonight, we're going to see a new Wildcat Heavyweight Champion. Even the Wildcat Heavyweight Champion. Mr. 450. There he is. Ladies and gentlemen, wearing pink and purple. Okay, Mr. Flashy. Ever since Steve Anthony returned to form of the exclamation point, Steve Anthony, he has been on quite the roll, becoming Wildcat Heavyweight Champion on Christmas night last December, defeating the longest reigning champion, Jay Spade. And he has been champion ever since. And he will be a tough task tonight going up against the enforcer, C.W. Anderson. Steve Anthony. Steve Anthony was the very first Wildcat heavyweight champion. He did inevitably lose that championship to the man that was just out here a moment ago, the Southern Stomper, Luke Hawks. This is his second reign as Wildcat Heavyweight Champion. Yes, it is. A former member of your employee, Harper. That's I right. I Steve Anthony was in the house of Harper. He's a very talented professional wrestler. I can tell you that. One of the true success stories, I guess you could say, at the house of Harper. I would say that. Signature Steve Anthony attitude. Steve 
Anthony gesture, the attitude is something that I don't say I can approve of, but you can't say that it hasn't translated to results. The reigning Waka heavyweight champion, Steve Anthony, about to defend oh that championship. Oh my God. Anderson. What? Steve Anthony just told our ring announcer not to pleasure himself with his power. Ugh. I don't know if that's appropriate for even us to be acknowledging. We didn't, we didn't have to bring that up, Ken. How did y'all not hear it? Championship gold on the line. The biggest prize here at Wildcat Sports about to be defended. There it is. One of the most coveted championships in professional wrestling today. Jay Spade, Stevie Richards, Matt Lancey. The man holding it right now, the exclamation point, Steve Anthony. There was a time with Steve Anthony, a gesture that he was the Methane Warrior. And during that time, he garnered a lot of uh, a lot of favor with the fans, but did not translate to a lot of victories. Yep, yeah, that's yeah, that and is since, true. And since he's gone back to his old ways, he's been winning. So you can't really judge a man as, as disgusting as his attitude may seem be. Even that right there. Getting in the head of C.W. Anderson. Swerving of the hips. Reminds you of a what? legendary ravishing Rick Rude. Simply ravishing. We talked about how Jay Spade was, had a tough break, but every time he lost to, Jace, to uh, Steve Anthony, it was not without an epic confrontation. They've had an epic feud. Steve Anthony also took this come off a huge victory against Jace Valor at an X-rated five event. Yes. These two very talented wrestlers lock up here. These are two very experienced competitors. You know that this is going to be where any small mistake is what the other one's going to have to capitalize on the beginning out process. Power of a tie up, both men just, just gesturing for. Let's say for a. Oh, the madness, but. So he gets Steve Anthony in the corner, reverse, still in Steve Anthony prepared for that strike. Honestly, that was a page out of Steve Anthony's book. You know that C.W. Anderson's going to be looking to hit that huge spine buster. Steve Anthony looking to hit the signature exclamation point. Come on, Waste Steve. Lock reverse. Just a bear, okay? for position. Steve, roll up. Come on. Looking for a win. Oh. And C.W. Anderson transitions to an arm bar. Steve Anthony had to let go. Could have been a three count. The quickness of C.W. No wasted motion in that one. No. Off the ropes. Oh, he goes for the shoulder tackle, but he does not move. C.W. Anderson is not a stranger to Wildcat Sports, but this is his first one-on-one -on -one championship match. Yes. You know he wants to make it count. Again, Steve Anthony going for the shoulder block. C.W. Anderson not budging. Ooh. Oh, oh. Down to the face. Disrespect to the champ. And now he goes down. He goes down. And again, a stalemate. You know these two men are very familiar with each other. This is both one side. These men have. If you've ever dreamed of becoming a professional wrestler, then now is the time to sign up with Wildcat Sports and Entertainment, the number one professional wrestling school in New Orleans, Louisiana. From tightening the ropes to running the ropes, from promo class to wrestling in the ring, Wildcat Sports offers classes to become professional wrestlers, referees, and even managers. Sign up today by visiting wildcatsports.com or email us at wildcatsports at gmail.com and start living your dream today. Similar wrestling style, and it's 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 unorthodox to see Steve Anthony in a fight with someone who wrestles just like him. I mean, Steve Anthony can likes to fly. Steve Anthony, Steve Anthony, he, I mean, to his credit, can really do it all. It's he just his attitude that I think people really disagree with. No one, no Whatever. one ever questions the, the technical ability of Steve Anthony. Oh, nice! And there it is. 
CW's going to look for an opening. Steve Anthony block. There you there go. Is. Huge Hurricane Rana from Steve Anthony. Quickness. CW Anson to the outside. Well, Steve's great, huh? Now, Steve's going not going to going wait. Over towards the audience. Taking a breather. Oh! Anthony meets him outside. Never He's really got to get him back in the ring. Yeah, you never know what's going to happen. It's not, it's not safe out here in the audience. Yes. You never know what might happen. C.W. throwing C.W. Anson's face first into a chair at ringside and a high five to a fan. And now C.W. down on the side. Anthony nice. his head off the ring, off the edge of the ring, the hardest part of the ring. And now brace the count. Brace the count. What you gonna do here? Oh, no, 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 he reversed it. At the last yes. second, CW sends Anthony right into the steel post. And now. Hovering over him, watching him, stalking him, waiting to strike like a cobra. The Rottweiler is in control of the match. See that has got to get Steve Anthony back in the ring. He can't win the championship oh. on the outside. He's at a Look disadvantage. At working over the arm. Stretching him across the pole. The left arm of Steve Anthony, but again, C.W. has got to get him in the ring. He can't win the championship. That's the right. Outside. He's got to get him in the ring to win the championship. Steve Anthony does not have to win this match. C.W. Anderson has to win this match if he plans on leaving here with the Wildcat Championship. That's it at best. You want to beat ah, the man. Beat the man. Steve Anthony's elbow. arm into the steel steps. Yes. That. Now what's this? Oh! oh and stomping on the first. And again, Steve Anthony, he could have stayed out, could have taken the count out victory and retained his championship, but you know that he's a fighting champion. He may not have the best attitude in the, in the world, but you know that he's a fighting champion. Come on, Stevie. Anderson going for the I think his um, arms, it, I think his arm is hurt bad. C.W. Anderson will now zone in on that arm. That will be the focus of this match, yes. I believe, for the remainder of this contest. And now put it on the rope. Can I have a five count to break? It's lucky if he doesn't break Steve Anthony's arm on that top rope. And for asking Steve Anthony if he can continue, he says he can. Of course he can. He's Steve Anthony. Man, you sound like a super fan right now. I'm just Steve saying, Steve Anthony bro. was a former protege of the House of Harper, now rallying back, huge chop, fighting back. Irish whip, re reverse, ah! oh, it's that left arm, grabbing with the left arm, and C.W. Anderson capitalized. Yes, yes, he. And now he, the enforcer continuing to beat down on Anthony's arm. He's showing just how smart he is as, as he is, he has separated that body part. He is focused on nothing else. Yes. That's and why he is the veteran that he is. Again, referee checking on Steve Anthony. You see Anthony wiggling his fingers, trying to get feeling, get the blood flowing back in his arm. It's hard to win a match if you only got one arm. Especially against the Rottweiler. Uh oh, could this be it? Nice whip. Anthony over, huge, going for the sunset flip. And again nice. to the arm, arm bar. Man, he's a pro. He can't break the connection. Steve Andy not letting him break the grip. And there it is. He has got it locked in. Steve Anthony has got to find a way. We got a new champion right now. It's cinched in in the center of the ring. Anthony's got to get to the ropes. He's got to try and shift his position. You can see him trying to gesture his legs over to the rope, get out of this contest, which and he does. And he does it. Break the hold. CW Anderson, let's go. You, can, you know that Anderson knows that he's in control. He's controlling the pace. He knows that he is in control. He will just continue to wear down on Anthony's arm, wear down on the champion's arm. Because if he ever get, if he gets that armbar in again, it's over for the champ. I would have to agree with you. And the thing is, CW is showing no nervousness. 
Now him lambasting the audience. He's not, you know, he's not gesturing to them. He's not doing anything flashy. No, no big high flying maneuvers. Just working over Anthony's arm, and the audience is not, is not hooping and hollering for it. And I think that's aggravating the enforcer. No, nice. huge uppercut from Anthony, and a forearm straight to the face. And then Anderson again a headbutt. He's fighting back. Ooh, they're going blow for blow. Trying not to use that arm. Going for the kicks. Again, even though not as much weight behind that Irish whip when he's in going to the arm. He can't capitalize. There we go. Another uppercut in the corner. She's back Second in Second uppercut. It. But notice after every move, that arm, that left arm comes right back down. He's feeling everything that he does. Again, pulling with the arm. Again, not as much force. Even you know that he's killing them. Nice. Oh my goodness, huge kick to this. But if he can kick. What's this? Oh, oh my goodness. Steve Anthony taking down CW Anderson, using his high flying ability to his advantage. Nice. I think the end may be near. And now Anthony going back up top, trying to get this audience back into this match. Harris position on the top rope. Huge oh. drop kick. Ladies and gentlemen, the height on that. Oh! Just two, only a two. Close call right there. And Anthony almost feels spent. You know, you know he, had, he had the momentum on his, on his side. Slowing down again. You know the arm still laying, hanging at his side. Working over Anderson yeah. as best he can. He's, he's still hurting, Steve is. Even climbing to the top, not using his arm. And now a couple of strikes. Now what's this? Oh, oh my goodness, huge fisherman buster from C.W. Anderson. Nice. A low clothesline. Hook of the leg. Kick out at two. two. Anthony is not going to give up the title that easily. So what do you do at this point? Now you you, you finally gotten back in control. You're wearing them down, but yes. your, your opponent is not going down out of fight. So how do you break the spirit? Are we, are we talking about Steve Anthony? We're talking about uh, C.W. Anderson. C.W. Anderson is just by his time. And there oh. it is! There it is! There's that the spinebuster! That's it! No! He kicked no. out! Ladies and gentlemen, he kicked out. Arn Anderson would have been proud. That yes. was a huge spine buster. You can count on one hand of how many people have kicked out from that. Steve Anthony still in this fight. And moves out of the way. Now he needs to capitalize. Anderson is down. Yes, this is the opening Steve, Steve needed. Then Mr. 450 landed right now. He's up top. You think he's going for the 450? It's his signature move. This is how he finishes it. Oh, no, no. Lands on his feet. Oh, did he uh, Did he tweak the ankle? I think he might think he, he might have hurt his ankle on that landing. I, going for another spine buster. Oh. Oh, my God. He folded him over. Huge. No. Oh, what? Again, only what? two. My God. He folded him over like a freaking pocket knife. You know, Cito is, is, is in disbelief, asking the referee, I can't believe he kicked out of that again. That shows the fighting spirit of the Wildcat champion, Steve Anthony. And now, Cito is going for another super kick. Line in wait, positioning behind Steve Anthony, waiting for him to get yes. up. It's all over. If he hits this in, you gotta believe this is it. And look at the defiant face of the champion. No, no. And then he catches it. Oh! What a nice strike. Man! One, two, three. Yes, Ladies and it. gentlemen. Man. That was a hell of a match. Anthony retains the title. An and epic he, battle. You know that that arm is going to be killing him tomorrow yes. to the end of the year. 
But when it's all said and done, Steve Anthony is still the Wildcat head.